In 2023, you may think using a keypad phone looks strange in a crowd, but once you choose a certain lifestyle, you will find it very useful. Hello, my friend. Come and meet our friend Qin Feng. Qin Feng was born in 2014, Shenzhen, China. We initially wanted to make a phone for the students, which should be convenient to live with. It should have basic communication functions, such as WeChat. It should have payment and code scanning functions. It should be able to search for study or other life problems at any time. It should be able to support taxi apps and the map navigation, etc. But at the same time, it should not be suitable for playing games and watching short videos. I mean, not suitable, not cannot. Modern Ultra Pro Max phones are great for browsing movies, social medias, and play phone games. And these apps are destined to take up a lot of your time. The internet has turned those glass-paneled cell phones into a magical box. That makes the idea of looking for it every now and then a habit. Slowly, you realize that you're not as productive at work as you thought you were. That's where Qin Feng comes in. Qin Feng F series abandons the traditional full screen design. The smaller screen makes you lose the immersion when you play games and watch short videos. And it's easier to peel yourself away from the internet. Both touch screen and a keyboard can be used, taking care of almost all age groups. Hey, don't worry if the keypad machine will look weird when used among youngsters. Maybe it will be an expression of your unique personality. Otherwise, the F22 series, which has a one-piece dustproof keyboard. Besides being dustproof, of course it is also waterproof. You can carry and use it in the rain. Qin Feng runs Android 11 or 12. All the apps you need will run excellently on the phone. The time saved by Qin Feng can help you explore some hobbies, reopen a book, or learn a new skill. Get the chin phone and maybe you won't keep it forever, but that time it spends with you might make you realize something. A digital minimalism. Alright, that's what this video is all about. Any comments or suggestions we hope you leave below here. We'd love to read it.